Hi there. Welcome to this math, math strategy video. We're going to show you how to solve different problems. Today, we're going to look at solving subtraction problems by using place value, but not crossing tens. We're going to try three problems. 85 take away 21, 267 take away 43, and if you're really brave, 539 take away 417. We'll use some different materials today to learn how to do this. We have place value cubes that come in ones, tens, hundreds, and thousands. We will also use a hundreds chart and some number lines. Let's get started. I'm going to show you a few different ways to do this problem. The first way that we are going to use is using place value cubes. So to make 85, I need eight tens, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. And I need five ones, which I have right there. One, two, three, four, five. So that's 85. I need to take away 21, which means two tens, one one. So I'm going to take away my ones first. So there's one and two tens, 10 and 20. And so I have left over six tens and four ones. So I did. 5 take away 1 equals 4, 80 take away 20 equals 60, and 60 plus 4 equals 64. Another way of doing that problem would be to use a hundreds chart. I can simply start at 85 and take away my two tens to get me to 65, and then take away one more. So I also have 64. A third way of doing this problem would be to draw a number line. On it, I can start with 85. And I'm first going to take away my 20, which gives me 65. And then I'm going to take away one more, which gives me 64. For the second problem, let's start with place value cubes again. So 267 take away 43 means I need to start with 267, and from that, I'm going to take away the 43. So there's 100 and 200, and then I'll get my six tens. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then I need seven ones. So two, four, six, and seven. I'm going to take away first the ones. So 7 take away 3 and I've got 7 there and that is 4 then 6 tens so that's 60 take away 4 tens which is 40 and that equals 20, 2 tens and I've still got all my hundreds so 200 take away 0 equals 200 so my answer is going to be 200 plus 20 plus 4 equals 224. To do that on a number line, again, I'm going to start at 267, and I'm going to take away my 4 tens, so that is 227, and then I'm going to take away 3 more, which is 224. This last problem might seem very hard, but if you use the same ideas that we tried in the other two problems, it's actually quite simple. We're going to start with our ones. So we've got nine ones, take away seven ones. So nine take away seven is two. Then we're going to start with, then we're going to continue with our tens, so three tens, which is 30. Take away one ten, which is 10, equals 20. And we're going to finish with our hundred, so five hundreds, Take away four hundreds equals one hundred. One hundred plus twenty plus two equals one hundred twenty-two. I hope that helped. After I'm done talking, I'm going to put some problems up on the screen for you to practice. Pause the video and try the problems. When you're done, unpause the video to check your answers. If you didn't understand something in this video, Go back and watch parts of it again. 
you can use the timestamps on the bottom of the video in the description to find the different problems. Thanks a lot, and see you next time.